Hi, welcome back. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a doll shopping bag easy. What you need is a box, ribbon, scissors, some hot glue, and duct tape. I'm so sorry, that's going to be in. I just have the duct tape. So, I got the duct tape. And you can get some paper. Y'all might notice that my background is different now that I'm making videos. That's because I was in Texas, but now I'm back here in Chicago. Yes, it is cold. It started to snow today again. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to cut off my tabs. So what you would do first is you would need to get your scissors to cut off the tabs. I'm showing you me cutting off the tabs. You can save the tabs if you want, but I'm not. Please go to that damn garbage. And it's easier for me to cut because it's straight there on the line. I have a line for mine. I'm just using a lemon head box, but raisin box would be fine for this and a nerd's box so now i'm going to take this this is where my duct tape will come in here i'm going to take my duct tape and pull off the tiny row so i can decorate it i'm making mine the pink one you can keep it as it is but for me i'm not so i'm sorry i'm just going to get a tiny Amount, a little bit more, just in case. I'm going to keep it. See, I'm cutting it. So now I'm going to sit it in my lap for you to cut it. But you know, you can you can it. Cut it long enough, as you can see, if you get enough. If not, you can always go back and cut some more, and to make it. I'm hoping I got enough. It's just the one that's cutting. Well, it's cutting, but, you know. There we go. Finally, I got it. My duct tape. Keep it as straight as possible. Now, now put your duct tape up there. Okay, I don't have enough, so I don't have to get some more. My box is too tall and too and not enough duct tape. So and make sure you put it up tight so you don't and try not to get as many of these bunches right here. You know, see on mine. So I only didn't get enough duct tape, so I'm getting some more now. Okay, I've cut me another piece. I'm hoping this is enough. Um, I'm just going to cut a small piece on this one because I don't really need that much. So, yeah. I'm sorry about the wrong bit. You know, I'm always apologizing when they're past a certain time because I don't want you to be bored. And saying this is something you can do under two minutes. Now, mine is a little bit longer because I'm going to explain it to you and stuff. I hope that you really understand it. Now, if you don't have a hot glue gun, I 
and you don't have duct tape, you can just take glue, regular school glue, wrap or glue stick for that, and just glue paper to it, tell the glue paper. Now, I'm just going to leave my just the way it is. I'm not doing the bottom or anything, but I'm going to go do the rest later. Now, I'm going to cut some ribbon long enough for both sides, so about About this long, it doesn't really matter, but I'm going to cut mine in half. Okay, now I've got two out there, I cut it in half. Now this is where your hot glue gun will come in here. Hot glue, your hot glue gun, take this and put it in there, and hot glue one in there. I hot glue my one drop in there, so it will stay. And then you do the other one. I put it in there for hand, so now you do the other one to make it stay that way. Now you got one hand glue. Now you will do the same to the other. Try to do it in the same place as possible. And be careful not to burn yourself. And please do craft at your own risk. If you burn yourself, I um, you ain't going to say nothing. But I hope you feel better because I warned you. And hot glue is very hot. Okay. Now your door has a shopping bag. And if you want, you take the piece of ribbon. And put it around here if you want. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go around this. Put some hot glue right there. Hot glue in there for it. Uh, so be very careful. And I'm just going to hot glue. Like this, carefully, being very careful. Now, I'm not thick that much. Now, I'm thick for some extra. Yeah. yeah. This is how mine look. It is only for 18 inch dolls because that was the only kind it fit. So, I hope you enjoyed it. You draw your little bag, put your own twist to it. You can even add the store name that you got it from. So, I could have got this from Kohl's. I'm just writing Kohl's. I hope I spelled the name right. Sorry, Kohl's, if I didn't. Anyway. This can be a Kohl's bag, American Eagle bag, but I get mine with the driving marker so mine comes off. I will recommend drive this marker but it is a dainty mark. But anyway, this is the craft. I'm sorry that it is so long, but I hope you enjoy it.